What is up guys, welcome back to a brand new video, today we're playing some more Days Gone, this is episode number 6, I hope you guys are enjoying this series so far man, thank you so damn much we support them, without further ado, let's dive straight back in. So we're going to be doing a mission today called Out of Nowhere, we need to drive pretty far uh, north to a, another mission, so that's what we're going to be doing today, smash that like button if you want to see more Days Gone on the channel, and without further ado, let's rock and roll. So usually, in other games, I would cut a lot of travel out, now Days Gone is a little bit different, because you can get jumped. Uh, at a moment's notice, shit can go wrong, like I'm, I'm probably going to leave most of the gameplay in, plus this game is freaking beautiful, so you know, I kind of want to show off as much as I can, uh, but yeah, let's go, let's rock and roll, and uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do a mission, so I think we're going to be riding very far up the end of the map, okay, yeah, so we're going to be going up here, searching the Pioneer Cemetery for Leon's drug stash, if you guys remember Leon, he was in the very first episode, I think we shot him in the face, but yeah, that's besides the point, what the mass fuck grave. happened here, mass grave, I keep forgetting it. So close to old Leary now. Don't ask me how. Oh. It's disgusting. Alright, so let's go. We're getting pretty close. 600 meters. Uh, so we're getting there. We are getting there very, very close. And we're going to go and see what is good in this mission. I have no actual idea what we're going to be doing. Um, only that it's going to be friggin' insane. This day is gone, man. We're going to be doing something good. Gotta watch out for that rock. There's some deer. There's a lot of enemies around here, but I don't know what. I don't know if it's wolves, zombies, freaking humans. There's a lot of enemies. No, I don't want to fuck with that. I just want to keep going. Keep my head down. Go ahead and do this mission. And get back to Boozer and my bed. <laughs> Pretty much. So let's go. Let's rock and roll. Let's see what's good. I love the sound of the bike. Infestation zone. There's another infestation down that way. Okay. Watch out. That one seems a little bit smaller than the one we've done in the... I think it might be the last video. And um, that one was only three nests. Well, the last one we done was six. So it's a little bit bigger. A little bit more infested, if you like. Here we go. We are here at the good old place. Let's rock and roll. Let's get off our bike. I'm actually going to make a quick, quick save here. Just in case. We have a spike bat. I've got a suppressed pistol now as well. Um, so that could help us out. What the hell? Oh, is it turning night? Oh, damn. Well, that sucks. Okay, well. Night's when the freakers come out, though. So that's going to make things a little bit more difficult. I guess that's how it goes. Shit, there's something over there. Okay, we've got to go this way. Okay, what is this? What the hell is this? Is it just... It's just blood for her. Oh, dude. I don't want to see this. Oh, Jesus. Oh, man. That sucks. And there's a bike. Motherfucker, man. What a sicko. Dude. It's all kind of bad. Okay, so this is the cemetery. Now, I do think there is a shit ton of enemies in here. And by a shit ton of enemies, I mean, of course, the Freakers. Oh, and there's one right there. Please don't turn around, Mr. Freaker. You're about to die, though. Or well, Mrs. Freaker, even. Okay, so this is the cemetery. There's a 2 by 4 there, but I think we're good. Weeping Angel. This has got to be it. Okay. Now, where'd you hide the stash, Leon? Pick that flower quickly. There's his broken right. crowbar. Where? Uh, maybe in okay. one of these. Okay, so it's in one of these. Let's try this one. Got it. Oh Jesus! Get this to. Shit! Can I drop you? Okay. Well, what the fuck? Holy shit! Boozer! Boozman, are you listening? Uh, oh, you're not gonna believe this. I just saw a goddamn chopper! A, a chopper? What, what are you talking about? I'm not too sure I'm gonna be able to get the jump on him. I'm gonna try. It, it just buzzed right over me and acted like I wasn't even there! Wait, all this time in a fed chopper <laughs> nice. out of nowhere? Yeah, I'm gonna chase him down and I'm, uh, uh, I'm gonna see what the hell they're doing! Okay. Hey, Deke. Be careful. Don't get too close till you know what the hell they're doing. 
Alrighty, Don't buddy. Do anything stupid. Hell no, I'm not gonna do anything stupid. How did that not kill him? That one did. There we go. Headshot. So the suppressor is gonna help us when it comes to actually dispatching the freakers. I'd imagine. Shit. I wonder. I could just quickly distract you. Mr. Zambi. Nice. There we go. Okay. Another freaker down. That is all of them in the area, I believe. Oh, shit. No, there's more. Mm. Fuck, man. There's always more. There's quite a few of them around that way. So we're going to go up here. We're going to go and throw this thing on the bike if we can. I think we can. There we go, baby. Let's go. So we're going to go check out the chopper, which is freaking insane. Oh, no. Okay. All right, zombie. Leave me be. How did I not kill him? Nice. Okay, well, 16 billion years later, we got the kill. Let's get out of here. Okay. Where are we going? Better turn them headlights off, man. We're kind of doing this a little bit stealthy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on. They're slowing down. Oh, Looks shit. like they're stopping. Okay, we're gonna leave the bike here. Okay. Okay. What the hell is happening? What the fuck is going on, man? I guess uh, we've got to be a little bit stealthy about this. Can I kill the people that are in the chopper? Can I gun it down? I mean, knowing me and like the way I play games, I probably would. I just, I, I don't know. I'm just an idiot. But yeah, that's why I probably fail for a lot of uh, objectives. Here we go, man. Nero. So, what was it in Nero checkpoint? I think it's like the government. These guys are the fucking real deal, man. Oh, I can't be fucking with these. Okay. Okay, so rocks are gonna be like my best friends here. Gotta go check them out. See what they're doing. I heard right. Gotta go in quiet. Okay, so Nero. Nero soldiers are researchers. Uh, they wear special armored hazmat suits and are immune to your attacks. Fuck. Okay, binoculars are marking. Okay, that's a good idea. We should probably do that right now. There's definitely one there. What kind of market? There we go. Over there. A handful of guys there. Is that all? So look, there's more. I saw a drifter. Almost got me seen. Okay, I am taking a huge risk here. Okay, nice. Why did I have to go and turn my fucking light on? Yep. Right, look over that way, douchebag. Get out of my way. Okay. Okay, turn back. That's it. Look down that away. Okay, I'm going to go down here. Shit, there's another one. What the fuck are they doing? After tracking a large moving group, estimated size of 5 to 600, we have confirmed the subject's hibernation location at... Hey Doc, I see Site 23 on the roster for tomorrow. Is that us? Oh shit. No, that's O'Brien. Got it. Oh shit, where was I? O'Brien? We have confirmed the subject's hibernation location at the High Desert Grotto, now designated Site 15. Trampling of grasses and plants at the entrance and the presence of footprints, see attached photos, okay. indicate the site has been used for some time. Must be nice and cozy in there. According to the motion sensor planted by Lieutenant O'Brien, approximately 447 subjects have entered the cave this morning. Recommend sending a follow-up team sometime after 1900 hours to assess the cave's interior and further assess conditions. Note to Dr. Anderson. Your theory about the subjects devolving to a primitive state Shit. of nocturnal behavior is seeming more appealing all the time. End report. Not going inside. Did you hear me? 
have 400 subjects, and these aren't just your regular run of the mill freaks. These are stage three. Okay, we got to get over there in that bush. No, no, and I asked if you were going in. Say I was. Bushes. I gotta keep these subjects are not sleeping; they're hibernating. Okay, that's it. Stay still, man. So we can eavesdrop. No. Ever woken up a hibernating freak? Yeah, actually. I was one of the survivors of the White King mine. Jesus. Someone tear my buddy apart like he was peeling a banana. These suits protect you from a lot of shit. But not them. Holy shit, Corporal. Damn, bro. Jesus, I'm, I'm sorry. That mission was foobar from the start. Which is why we... Are not going inside there. I think if I sealed up this cave, we'd, I don't know, knock down their population. I don't know, Corporal. A lot of caves out here. Come on, let's get out of here. Seal the caves. Yeah, yeah. Right, like anyone gives a damn. I really hate these assignments. Yeah. Okay, we need to move. Let me guess. You'd rather be in the Belknap Caves. Yeah, I'll do it in a minute, though. Try and roll out of here, man. This could be tricky. Seeing I can't climb up, motherfucker. Oh, oh, get back in the bushes. Okay. I'm gonna go around this way. Let's wait for that douche to turn. There we go. Okay. Good job we have our trusty rocks, am I right? Okay, we're gonna get in this bush in case that douchebag moves, which I think he will. Yep, straight away, as if on cue. Dude, can you just look like down there? Just for a minute, until I can get past, please. That's it, off you go. You fucking dick. Okay, off we go. We're gonna sneak around here. I'm gonna keep moving. I know there's someone up near the ridge. There he is. Okay, right. So we're gonna get you. So look. Down that. Mm. I don't know. Okay, turn around. And you. What kind of throw a damn rock? Jesus, this is taking forever. You look over there. We're good, baby. Let's go. Back to that damn bike. Jesus. Okay, that was insane. That was freaking insane. I had no idea if I was going to get in and out of that mission alive. If I was going to be able to do it first time. And uh, I'm super glad we did. Because, uh, I mean, it was a freaking awesome mission. Um, but, yeah, I, I thought I was going to die. I thought I was going to get absolutely slaughtered by them guys. And they was going to catch me every ten seconds. But we done it, man. We're a ninja. They go just like that okay so they're up to something I don't know if they're the government or what they are I, I guess so I guess they're kind of like the government in the sense that um, they're doing shit like this but they're not sleeping finding Nero goal Nero the national emergency response organization what are they doing out here okay nice we got a residue bolt okay that's pretty cool okay I know there's zombies on my ass don't worry, guys, I'm going. Okay, drive to location. Price on your head? What the fuck is that? Booze man, come back. D. Hey, I'm here. You're going in a farewell. The Nero, the soldier. Who took Sarah. Oh, shit. He had an ID badge. What was the name? Oh, God, O'Brien. Oh, gonna shut up about it. All the way out to Three Finger Jack. He's alive. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you talking about? The fuck? Over there, the whole camp was wiped out. No, I know that, but I heard... I went into their LZ. Like... Wait, wait, you went into their LZ? What the... Just listen. On the radio. Talking about a man named O'Brien. Pink, don't. Not, Boozer. I'm not. I'm just... Hey, uh... Get some sleep. Dig it out. Okay. Alright, so what are we doing now? Map has been complete. 
Uh, we got the... Oh, shit. There's a lot of stuff up there, man. There's a lot of infestations. So we're going down toward... Where are we? We're going all the way over there. What the fuck is over there? Price on your head. Meet with the Tucker and Alka. Okay, so we're there. What I'm going to do, we're going to go and get some fuel first. And the reason for that is because we're about halfway in terms of fuel. So yeah, we're going to go and stock up on that. We're probably going to go and have a sleep as well. This is so we are a little bit more prepared. So this shit is a little bit of a journey, man. I don't know. What are the government doing out here? It's super weird. Super interesting at the same time. Let's go. We're going to go back to the house, get some fuel. Then we're going to go and meet them guys and uh, try and make sense of what the fuck is going down, man. We've got to travel quite far in this video, so it will probably be a long one. Uh, but I don't mind that, man. I do not mind that. Let's go. Okay. We need to get back up to the uh, house. Okay, so if you win this game, the windows very, very, very quickly. Use up so much damn gas. No, Cope, the cemeteries are filled with freakers, not martyrs. And you had to keep moving, because if anyone had found your unmarked van, they would have blown it to hell. Just so I wouldn't have to listen to your bullshit radio pre organ. Damn. <laughs> Some shit going down. Oh fuck my bike. Oh cow, why do you drive like such an idiot? Okay, we need to get over here and grab some fuel though. Off the tank. Let's fill that up. Glug, glug, glug. Nice. Beautiful. A nice full tank of fuel. Ready for our journey. 1.7 kilometers. That is a lot, man. It's a lot of journey and we're going to be doing. Let's go. We're going to set off out. We're going to go and drop off this uh, supply drop kind of thing. Whatever the hell this is. The hidden stash. I think he said of drugs. And I think by drugs, I hope he means like medical supplies. Uh, but we're going to find out. Um, I don't know if Deacon does drugs. Um, I don't know. But yeah, let's rock and roll. Let's see what we're going to be doing. And hopefully it's all good uh, when we get there. Not many freaks now. Please. I think we've seen our fair share, man. Just saying. I do feel like we're going to run into some dickheads along this uh, along this way because it is a new area we're going into. So there might be people trying to defend their territory, you know, stuff like that. I can see happening. Uh, but yeah, let's just rock and roll. Let's get down there. We've got a little bit of a journey and then we will see. There's been a lot of traveling in this episode, not a lot of murdering, um, which is kind of nice. It kind of breaks up the episodes, I think, uh, which is pretty good. Okay, we've got like a oh, this is the Nero checkpoint. I remember this. Are we going through that fucking tunnel? That means we should be going past crazy willies in a minute, so that's going to be fun. Okay, coming through. I don't know if the zombies re-nest either, if they nest in places that they have already nested in, if they've been destroyed, if that makes sense. Um, I have no idea if that is the case. Um, I, I shouldn't really call them zombies. They're called freakers. I know the devs get... Um, I think someone said it in an interview. They're like, oh, the zombies, and they're like, dude, no, freakers is what they're called, not zombies. <laughs> so, yeah, they're called freakers. <laughs> um, okay. The hell is that? Is a bird flying around? Okay, this is Crazy yeah, Willies. I remember this place. Burn out the rest of these nests. This place was terrifying. Don't mind me, Crazy Willies. I'm just going to drive through. I want no beef with you guys, man. Don't worry, fellas. I'll be back later. Finish burning you out. Oh, there's fuel there. And something as well. My bike is actually... Actually smoking, which is bad. Can I repair you? I can fix this. There we go. Good. Nice. No more smoke. Should we go and top it up with fuel? I know it is infested with zombies. But we might need some for the road. Let's go. I think what I'll do is top it up with fuel. And then end the video. Okay, let's go. Let's just fill you up real quick. I oh, know there's zombies. Oh, fuck. That could have been bad. If that had exploded, man, that would have been no damn bike, no damn deacon, and no damn drug stash. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do, guys, is end today's video here. Thank you so damn much for watching. If you have enjoyed today's video, smash the like button, comment and subscribe, and I will see you for more Days Gone next time. So, awesome, guys. Have an amazing day, and I will see you all again in the next video.